Um, so now I'm going to cut my fabric O strips. It's exactly the same, um, only it's going to take a lot longer because they're thinner and I need a lot of them. This is one place where um, if you have the Stripology XL ruler, it's really useful because um, you can you don't have to keep moving the ruler. You leave the ruler down and cut, cut, cut. I do not use my Stripology ruler to cut with the fabric strips because I don't have the XL one and it almost always doesn't cut the very top and then I have to go through and cut it with scissors anyway and it just really irritates me. So I don't use it for this. So I'm gonna use my regular ruler. Oh, you can't see the fabric. There we go. All right. Um, so I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna look at my table and see how many fabric O strips I need. That's the last column on the right in the lighter blue color. Um, I need a whole bunch, which is good because I got a whole bunch of fabric. And I'm gonna do the same thing where I'm going to cut a little bit extra on the first strip, flip it around and then trim it down to the right size, which will cut off the extra that I just cut. So, um, if you're cutting, if you're making the fat quarter version, obviously this is way longer than a fat quarter. So I would just take some scissors or your rotary cutter and just cut it right on the crease at the top so that you have two shorter strips. Um, and that, that'll work. So every time I cut, I'm making sure that um, it lines up with the vertical line on the edge of the fabric and the horizontal line on the crease. Because otherwise you'll cut strips that are going to be, um, wh where the fabric is folded, it will, will not be straight. And that will cause problems when we go to strip piece our fabric in the next step because your fabric will not be straight. And then when you try to make it straight and sew it onto your other fabric, um, it will not sit flat and it will create problems. So usually after a few strips, I say, okay, uh, it's not as straight as it once was. So I'm going to square up again and I'll do it on this one. So I cut a little bit of extra. Yeah, it's not quite square for this one. And then I flip it over very carefully. Um, and trim it down. 